What's up everybody, welcome back to Selenix Crypto and welcome to this video in which we will not only discuss the price of BNB and do an analysis on that, but we'll also talk about everything that's going on around Binance. Um, because there, there's some news around Binance, some um, well, some are calling it FUD and other uh, people are calling, calling, it, uh, calling it news. I'm not sure, I mean in the end, who am I? Who are we? We don't have all the information. Uh, but to me, what it seems like, it, it seems like FUD, all right? I think Binance is still solid. They have had their reserves um, audited and they do have enough reserves for everybody. So if everybody wanted to withdraw their, their funds right now, they would actually have an amazing day in, in revenues. Um, however, it, it did cause the price to drop down quite uh, quite badly, as you see. Uh, we first already had a bearish, uh, bearish breakout through 275. And then we drop down all the way to this level around 250 and 260, which is a very strong support level. So naturally that did hold. Um, but altogether it, 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 caused, um, it, it caused quite a big drop. And then what happened about, uh, about an hour ago is we actually got a, a lower than expected inflation rate. So that is causing us to, to go back up. And apart from that, what I also think is I think it's just that, that people are realizing that Binance is fine. Or at least it seems like Binance is fine. I mean, if, if, if you want to take a look at uh, what's going on, there are multi multiple um, reasons for why we are bearish. I mean, there was some criminal investigation into money laundering, maybe starting from the US into Binance. Um, and, uh, and, and yeah, and CZ is, 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 is right now, um, is now saying some things about it uh, apart from that it was also that that some uh, major market makers so people that had a lot of money um on binance they were they were pulling some money out you can read more about this on coinback uh, coindesk.com and then this so a lot of withdrawals and a lot of big withdrawals from big companies as well causing a lot of fear right the main thing why i think that's happening i could be wrong about that but the main thing i think why it's happening is because people are, are scared of what happens with ftx and people just don't want to have that risk, which is good. I mean, it's good to get your uh, funds off of centralized exchanges. And I think Binance itself also agrees. But but I mean, as far as Binance itself goes, is it's fine. All right. It, it seems like that to me. So right now, the price of BNB, which is obviously heavily linked to the performance of Binance, uh, is also going up right now. The main thing is, is um, is we, we what I thought, I mean, when I did the analysis price was still down here. I thought we would get up to this resistance level at uh, 280, 275 again, uh, which we have done. Uh, there's quite a lot of bullish uh, bullish momentum right now in the market, as I said. To me, it still looks like I do think we'll break above 275 and 277. We could do that now. If we do that, we'll find resistance at 282, take a break retest and probably get up towards this level here at 286 and 288. And then we'll stay kind of here until we get the new big fundamentals tomorrow, which is going to be the interest rate, which is going to make the market move again, but more about that tomorrow on the channel. Um, so yeah, sure, we could break above that now. I think it's a little, little bit more likely as we hit a major resistance level already that from here we will actually retrace a little bit and that uh, down to like 270 and that from there we'll be able to kind of start to break above 277 and 275. And uh, that will be in this range between like 284 and 275 when uh, when the uh, fundamentals hit tomorrow, and then uh, depending on whether the the, uh, the Federal Reserve is hawkish or dovish, we we'll either get get up to 292 and 296, or we'll drop down to 260 and to uh, 265 again. So more about that as I said uh, tomorrow. But for now, that's my take on everything that's going on with Binance and BNB. So take care. Bye and have a great day.